Um, do you guys think that for self-defense purposes it matters whether you have 10 or 15 rounds in your magazine? Probably not. Yeah. But no, probably not. Yeah. Um, honestly. And, and we're gun owning people. I don't keep a loaded gun in my home. Uh -huh. I, I'm not afraid like that. I have, I don't know how many guns I've got. I yeah. may have 30 guns. I do not keep a loaded weapon in my home. Just defending yourself. Um, personally, would it matter whether you had a, a magazine with 30 rounds, 15 rounds, 10 rounds? Uh, not really, I don't think. Yeah. Self-defense purposes, for example. Do you think it would matter whether you had 10 or 30 rounds in your, in your gun? It takes one shot to kill. Anything more than one shot is excessive. Oh, right. I mean, someone's breaking into your house, out of panic, you're probably going to shoot them once. You're not going to empty your load on them while right. they're laying on your kitchen floor. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. Like yeah. 10, 30, what's the difference, right? So there's there's that line, you know? Yeah. And if someone were to use a gun solely for self-protection purposes, would they need 10 or 30 rounds? I oh, I not. see. I, I, I don't know why. I mean, yeah. if, if 10 rounds of ammunition can't do the job, Fair point. <laughs> Probably shouldn't own the gun, you know. Yeah. I mean, I, yeah. I don't want to live next to that guy. Yeah. So. No, if you're a dead shot, you need one, you know. Yeah. If somebody breaks in your house, you need one. If you, so. you know, if you're one of these spray people, you, you need a lot. <laughs> Fair enough. If you're a bad shooter, you probably need a lot. If you're a, yeah, yeah. If you're a SWAT guy on the side and somebody walks into your bedroom, you probably only need one. Yeah. 